So I finally updated the 650 with uh, central hydraulics. So it's so much faster now. So got the solenoids. Uh, good adjustment block there. That's that is. So I can adjust the speed up and down. Uh, those are all the solenoids. It gives me one for uh, hydraulic winch, which I haven't put in yet. Um, it's pretty expensive, so I think I'll go with the electric till that fails. Uh, I got my filter there. Uh, my tank. Uh, it's a 15 gallon tank. It's a 12 gallons per minute system, so um, should be fine with the 15. Got my hoses. Got a couple loose ends. I get to take this back and have it shortened up. But I'd rather have too much length than not enough, so I'm just gonna have that shortened up to fit in there a little bit better. It's a little long right now, um, but yeah, use, was able to use the same ram. It's uh, I'd say about 10 times faster. A little shot of the back side. Wiring box. All my wiring that goes in my controller is in there. Um, same controller as before uh, that was used on just the electrical system. So I have my hoist. Winch, winch is on electric, so winch still works. Even with the truck off, hoist up and down won't work now because the truck's off. It's the only downside to the system. Uh, my little switch is right up in here. So that turns the clutch pump on and off. And then, the wheezy, and it's right here. It's pretty simple to install. The fuel filter had to go sideways, but Overall, it's pretty, pretty nice setup. Ended up having to uh, custom order a belt because what came with the system was for AC, and my truck doesn't have AC. So overall, it's an awesome system. Goes a lot faster. Um, I mean, it's just insane. I like it a lot better. I think it'll be a lot nicer. So that's my system. That's the truck. Finally back together. Just gotta do a couple more things, and it'll be perfect. Thanks for watching.